In marriage, there must be, above all, companionship and care of husband and wife for each other, both in sickness and in health, and on every occasion. Each party entering into a marriage desires this, after all, just as they desire children. When this mutual care is complete, and those who live together provide it to each other completely, each competes with the other to surpass the other in giving such care. Such a marriage is admirable and deserves emulation. Such a partnership is beautiful. Colin, as soon as I met you, I knew that this was something special. That night, I remember being so captivated by your confidence, your sense of humor, and your overall presence. I immediately felt so comfortable and safe with you, which was kind of crazy because we had just met at the bar 20 minutes prior. <laughs> Olivia, when I first met you in 2018, I knew right away that I wanted to marry you. Locking eyes with you felt like a warm ray of sunshine. Spending time with you feels like a relief from the stresses of the world. You're a beautiful person in so many ways. The sound of your laugh just lights me up. Two months after we met, I asked you to move to California so we could build a life together, and it was the best decision I've ever made. He's one of the most resourceful, uh, smartest, and motivated people that I know. Uh, and I'm very proud of the man that he has become. And I know mom is, and I know Dan and grandma were as well. Not only did Colin befriend a scraggly looking kid like myself, but his dad and his ma took me in like I was their own. They both played a huge role in my life and I'll never forget that. I know your dad, Mr. Breyer, is looking down on you today and he's so proud of you. Who the man you've become, Colin. After she finished school and then she went on a trip to Chicago, and we all know it's St. Patrick's Day, and we kind of started hearing about this guy. And all we knew was his name was McGuire and he had a good vibe. We just, we, we heard about the vibes. Liv is unapologetically herself. She will represent so hard the people that she loves and the things that she cares about and believes in. And um, she says what's on her mind all of the time, for better or worse. And so when she first met Colin, I believe she said something along the lines of, um, aren't you going to ask her my number now? Which I just, um, I love that story because I didn't know who would be Liv's best match, like who would be her most complimentary self. Um, I didn't know who that would be until I met Colin. And if you know Colin, right away you know he's super driven and passionate and inspiring. And um, it's really easy to see how Colin's humor and charm and optimism just light up live when they're together and light up a whole room 